my god! Goldberg with the spear! Right through the ladder outside! AW deal with the swan! Just table, don't do it! Don't do it! AWU, oh my god, what the frog. Welcome, AWU Universe. And tonight, sadly, AWU isn't here. He just gave me some notes and told me to tell the universe that the Shield are gonna have a special announcement here tonight, and I cannot wait to see what it is. And oh my god, as soon as the shield were about to say something, it looks like the fiend is making a return here tonight. My god, the fiend is lurking behind the shield and they don't know it. But who is this? Who is this person? We've never seen this person ever. Oh my god. It's AWU. AWU and the fiend are now official. AWU has now joined the dark side. They're gonna blindside attack the shield. AW takes out Roman, a sleeper hold on Moxley. Oh, and the Fiend with the backbreaker here. Roman hitting AW in the back with a microphone. The Fiend staring down Roman Reigns from across the ring. Roman trying to help Moxley up. And uh, the Fiend grabs Roman by the hair. Oh, and a Mandible Claw already off the bat. With the Mandible Claw taking down Roman Reigns and trying to pass him out here. AWU with the curb stomp getting his revenge and it looks like the fiend and AWU has taken out the shield officially you think you know me. oh my god oh my god rated RKO is it true they're coming down Randy they're running down they seem like they're in a rush but for what oh and look at this stare down the rated RKO versus AW and the Fiend. AW and Randy have some past. And what is gonna happen here? Edge and Randy going after Roman Reigns with the double RKO. And I can't believe what's happening right now. Another stare down. Oh my god, and the Fiend attacking Edge with the sister Abigail. Oh my god. And it looks like AW wants. Randy to join them. Oh my god, RKO out of nowhere. Randy betrays AWU. And look at the stare down. Oh my god, Mandible Claw. Oh, and a body slam into the Mandible Claw. And AWU and the Fiend are dominant. Alright everybody, 
and we're gonna move on from that terrifying slash crazy moment we just saw right there and move on to the Intercontinental Championship qualifying match, Battle Royal. Universe, and we're gonna kick off tonight right after that shield announcement with an eight man Battle Royal and whoever wins that eight man Battle Royal will go on into an Intercontinental Championship qualifying match and the main event tonight will reveal the other half of the qualifying match so it will be Kevin Owens versus Finn Balor at the main event for who gets a qualifying match and here comes AJ Styles
And it looks like everyone's gonna go after Cena here. The most experienced. Oh, and it looks like I'm correct. Everyone is jumping Cena in the ring. And now they're gonna part ways off of each other. Looking for a Batista bomb. They can't quite get it. The biggest man in the ring right now is Keith Lee. Keith Lee looking to deliver a power bomb of his own to Batista. And a super kick to Lee. Almost eliminating Keith in the beginning. But Dolph can't quite do that. Chris and Apollo in the corner. Apollo with a hard striking knee to the face of Chris Jericho. Oh, uh, Dolph Ziggler getting caught. Looking for the AA. Oh my God, and the attitude adjustment connects. What's going on over here? We got AJ Styles and Ricochet with the Hurricanrana. Almost eliminating Ricochet. Ricochet landing right in the ring like a superhero right now. What's going on here? Batista using the ropes leverage for a Batista bomb to Keith Lee. That must have hurt right there. We got Cena and Dolph in the corner. Dolph with a zigzag to Cena. Oh my God. Oh, we got a roll through and a super kick to Apollo. And Apollo's down and out right now. We got Ricochet. Oh my God, a Pele kick to Ricochet from AJ Styles. Oh, and Apollo Crews is the first one eliminated. We got AJ Styles almost looking for elimination there. Code breaker to AJ Styles. He should have never done that. And everyone seems to be down except for this big man. Moonsault on a Batista. A big moonsault. What's Ricochet looking to do here? What is that? Oh my god. What maneuver was that? Ricochet. The high flying man of this ring. Oh my god. Wait. Looks like AJ still in it. Uh-oh, but Ricochet is holding AJ's leg. Oh my god, and AJ just gets pounced by Keith Lee. And they're both eliminated. Can Batista eliminate the big man? Oh, and he can't quite get him up. Oh. Chris going after Dolph. Backbreaker to Dolph Ziggler. Cena. Can he eliminate Chris Jericho? And a super kick to the back of the head and Chris is eliminated but Cena somehow stays in under the ropes Keith Lee what the oh my god what the pounce to the announcer's table we need some medics oh my god and Dolph Ziggler is eliminated but we need some medics out here for Batista the ref is checking on Batista uh oh Keith Lee looking to push in on Cena trying to eliminate him and now they're both on the edge this is not a good, oh my God. And John Cena wins with the AA on the apron. John Cena gets a qualifying match for the Intercontinental Championship. And since we just watched John Cena do the unthinkable, we're gonna watch the main event. It'll be Kevin Owens versus Finn Balor for the qualifying match. A uh, contender's spot to face John Cena for the Intercontinental Championship. Welcome, AWU Universe. And tonight, we will get the other half of the qualifiers match for the Intercontinental Championship. And here we have Kevin Owens himself fight anyone. And we will, he will be going against Finn Balor to qualify against John Cena. Oh, and a cheap blow by Kevin Owens. 
right before the match starts. He's looking for a uh, power bomb. Oh my god, and a sent out power bomb onto the ground. And Finn Balor's back has to be hurting for the rest of this match. Oh, and a kick out at two from Balor. The strength from Finn Balor right now kicking out from this sit out power bomb onto the hard floor right now. Uh, they seem to be climbing the stage. I wonder where they're going. And it looks like they're going backstage. What is Kevin thinking of? He's picking up Finn Balor right now. Finn Balor reverses and throws Kevin on the table. Where's Finn Balor going now? He's opening up the locker room door and climbing the stretcher. He's climbing the door. Uh-oh. I know where he's going. Oh, my God. And a swanton bomb from the top of the locker room door to take out Kevin Owens. But can he capitalize? And what is Finn thinking of doing? He is not pinning Kevin. He is taking him back to the arena. What does he have in mind? And it looked like they're going to the top of the stage. But Kevin, uh, quick with his feet and quick with his reflexes. Oh my god. And I said I'll powerbomb onto the box right outside of the arena. Right next to the, to the fans and the ref quickly rushing down here to cover this pin by Kevin Owens and can he win oh my god in the strength from Finn Balor kicking out at two again but what does Kevin have to do to get that three on Finn Balor to secure his spot in, in the qualifying match against John Cena he looks to be climbing the top rope here what does Kevin have in mind oh my god and an elbow drop from the top can he get it and another kick out by Finn Balor. Finn Balor holding up strong in this match right now. Kevin not knowing what to do. But Finn Balor is already up with a drop kick to Kevin. Kevin is down. And at this point, Kevin does not know how to beat Finn Balor. And Finn Balor is just running circles around Kevin Owens. What a coup de grace right to Kevin. Can this be it? One, two, and three. And Finn Balor wins easily and gets to face John Cena for the Intercontinental Championship oh and Finn Balor doesn't look to be too good and the ref is checking on him but while Finn Balor is getting checked out uh, here's some replays from the match and see you guys on the next show And it doesn't look that Finn Balor is going to compete for a little bit. They went all out on this match. And see you guys on the next video. We will see John Cena versus Kevin Owens for the championship.